Hello, hello, as everybody is sleeping in Marta's household at the moment, this isn't gonna be a very long episode, more like maybe 30 minutes. Uh, Emily wanted to talk with us. Do you think of the house? That's really nice. Telling the truth. I told Annie that Nervous Object loved her and she still loves him too. Do you hear that, Nervous? Anna loves you! So, he really gone? Walk into the master bedroom and see. Okay, here it goes. So yeah, I went back here and I did some stuff in order to, you know, get my aspiration back up and stuff and... Yeah, hey, we're ghost free. Except for Emily Cookie. But yeah, I came back home to do a lot of aspiration stuffs to make myself not upset. Do, do you have any special lines? Uh, all discussed around, I should start charging rent. I don't think you'll get much money out of our friends here, but... Could invite a couple of roommates to stay here if you wanted to. And I could charge them rent. Rent might be a bit much, but... I think that might be against the zoning regulation or something. Then what's the point? Aside from friendship, they could help you pay the bills. So if you invite people here, your bills get cheaper. Yes. Interesting, I'll think about it. So that's all of the lines from her. And let's check, that's done. Yeah, the rest of the things I think are just in debt, Trina. So how about it, guys? How about we progress out of debt tree this time? Oh god, my mouse was on screen, so sorry. Uh, it, they're not supposed to be a mouse there because this is done PSP emulator. Hence my computer mouse sometimes gets in the way. But I'm playing it with a PS4 controller because that's like the most similar thing to my PSP. Off the button layouts are the same and stuff, guys, so like, I'm super happy. Mm. Oh, yeah. Uh, I was a bit, like, cheap, so I looked up a guide as to where that object in the graveyard is. So I know for sure that it's to the right and not to the left. I think. Uh, yay! It's here! See guys, I found it! And examining... That Vittorio Florica. We just completed the goal. We turned treasure to Peta and became friends with... The vampire girl. Yay! Not a lot of... Whoa! Not a lot of things left to do. Avoiding those zombies like a pro. Instead of running into them like a crazy ass like I did the last time. I'm not good with zombie avoidance. There's trash all over the floor. You should clean up town. I found your treasure. It's a uh, viola. Of course it is. Look at the reddish stain in the wood. It was my family's signature. This is the only surviving instrument. How fascinating. I have at it. Thank you. Come back anytime. Maybe I'll even give you a discount on my goods. Sounds good. Bye. There's another thing. Brew a smart milkshake potion. I want to see if you can actually do that on a crafting table. Because that is one of our... Yeah, you can. All I need is milk. Okay. Because that is one of our aspiration goals and I'm pretty sure that we will have to do it eventually. Do you have any milk? 
There. Where's my where's my bun? Ah, diamond ring. That's like a proposal thing. No, no milk. But it's good to know that it has a cow on it. It should have milk in it. Do you have any milk? They have already pre-made smart milk. This is preposterous. How can you call yourself a cow society and have no milk? That being said, now we need to find a Miss... Uh, Virginia. Does Virginia hang out in the bar by any chance? If she doesn't, I'm lost. You're not... Are you... Oh, you, you are Virginia. Nice jacket you got there. Yeah, I guess. Okay, bye. Yay, befriending Virginia for the win. Oh my. Ouch. Oh, that friendship did not end up well. On top of that, it was kind of one of the harder people to befriend because desserts do not equal food people so if somebody goes my favorite thing is a milkshake and you reply with I love eggs that's not the right answer Virginia Feng is a vampire and has been undead since the 19th century and why the hell did you do that I'm so sorry I didn't mean to do that what did you just do I Bit you! I'm so sorry! I wasn't planning to, I just... What are you nuts? I deserve an explanation! Oh look, it's just something I do! Don't want to do it, but this feeling comes over me and... And what? I just have to bite someone, that's all! It's so embarrassing, I'm sorry! You should be sorry, I hope you didn't give me a disease! <laughs> See, that's the thing. Oh no, what? You're HIV positive. Well, now that I've been here, there's a chance to um, spit it out. Well, you might just be a vampire. So, you're a vampire. That explains the random biting of people. And well, you might be okay, most people are. How do you know if I am? If it hurts to go out the sun, if you start getting hungry all the time, in a hippo, and you might need to go and bat someone's neck. Is there something I can do? A cure? No, that's the horrible part. I've been looking for a cure for over a hundred years. Didn't you find anything at all? Nothing. All I could do was keep biting people. Uh, okay, now this is where we come in after a hundred years of lazy research and yeah, yeah, fix yeah, yeah, everything. Yeah, 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 uh. That sounds awesome! I would love to shirt off your back for... Fleur? ...stuff. Yeah, I know exactly who to ask for a cure. No problem, you deserve a break. And I don't want to be a vampire because it's slightly inconvenient. Mambo Lu! Really me? That that's Well first of all Did that do anything? Yes, thank god. Well now we kinda need to use the bathroom. Mambo Lu of all people! Oh my, there's a secret in the bathroom. The key to instant romantic success? Lower your standards. Yeah. Why would we go to Mambaloa? I think I'm missing something. It, it, also, it's kind of funny how, how in, in reality it would be like, Immortality, yeah! And in games you're like, this is slightly inconvenient. Now I can't quest at daytime. Oh well, time to 
Go all the way back to the station place. Is this the right? Yes, this is the right road. Yay for the right road! Service station. Aw, now we're super tired. We'll have to do something about that. Hello! There might be vampirism going around. I don't know why other people just didn't just come to you. I'll, I'll give you some cash. Just, just don't be mad at me. And then you can you can cure me of vampirism and everything will be just fine. Yeah. Oh wow! Her relationship didn't cost that much. Some low prices actually have a bit of a vampire problem. Oh no, this is very serious. Where's the vampire? I'm the vampire. That's the problem. Um is it a Uh well what you need then is a vampire cure potion. It just existed right over here. Um, nobody from that tree decided to just go here. Do you sell them? Very funny joke. No, why not? How many vampires do you think come in here? You think I can make a profit? Well, obviously the ones that wanted a cure did not find your shop. Maybe you should think about advertising. Perhaps some posters in Dead Tree. I need to make it myself. Easiest thing in the world. A few ingredients. What kind? Oh my God! The Osha. Garlic and a liter of human blood. Whoa, blood! That's what we'll do. He give us your hard debt, Hevaba. Okay. We're good. This thing is easy to sort. Well, it might cost a bit, so we might want to earn some money first. And I think that by the time I'll be running past my house, I will be like passing out from wanting sleepy, so I should probably drop by in my house and have a sleep. That sounds reasonable. No, 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 no. Go home faster. Go home faster. Faster home. Now I only need to take steps till bed. Steps till bed. Sleep. I think we made it, guys. We did not pass out. Good for us! Okay, we're feeling all better now. Do we have a wish to just build any kind of skill point? Because if if we do, that might be very useful. Yeah, it is very useful. Because I wanna... No, cancel. I, I wanna earn a little bit of money. And painting is actually a good way to do this. Except that this is gonna take friggin' forever. Come on, my bun hand, don't... Lose focus. There we go. Phew. Yes, I would like to sell this. This is good. Okay, now we can sleep again. Feeling a little bit better, aspiration wise, and feeling a little bit better ourselves wise, so yeah. Everything's good, good. Oh, I should have checked that Mambo actually sells thingies. Milk. Bills have arrived. That's what I forgot. I forgot milk. Do I have anything I could gift? No. Shame that. Oh well, use the showery poos for extra aspirations. Plus, we're feeling clean, so that's nice. And then we're gonna pay our bills and be on our way. 
don't even know if we actually caught vampirism. I don't think that we did. What kind of perks? No, we do have vampirism perk. Well, if we wanted, we could keep it. But like I said, RPGs. So instead of it being kind of nice, it makes life slightly inconvenient. So you're like, nah. I don't want that. And people might be like, oh, but immortality would suck because everybody around you will die. Well, my roommate seems to be a ghost, so like, I think I'm fine. Like, my only real friend is a ghost, so we're good. Okay. One, two, one, two. Uh, this is a bit pricey. Oh, thank god we got all that extra money. And the people are like, wait a minute, Marta, you used to have more money. It's like, yeah, and then I bought a computer because that's what my aspiration said to do. Oh god, it actually costs to craft it? Well, shit. Uh, let's see if we can earn a little bit of money. There we go. Okay, needs bathroom a lot again. So I'm gonna use this and then I'm gonna have a bath. Because you has a bath here. And now we have enough money to for, for cheap potions, thank god. Your bathtub's really nice, sir. In other words, we will be able to stop being a vampire and stop being hungry all the time. And it won't be as not convenient to be outside. Come on, let's go and craft while it's still morning and let's pray that that doesn't kill us. Though, I don't know why do I have to pay money to the workbench. How does that make any sense, game? Still like ingredients that I can't normally buy? Okay, current perks. Use that. Yay! Well, that fixed us. Use the potion. Now it's time to give a gift. Give the gift of a potion. Where are you? Hello. Got this potion right here. Give it to me, give it to me. Don't you want to think about it first? Hey! Go, go, go. Did it work? Well, we know that it did work because we just drank it ourselves. Stay away from you, foul creature! No, stupid. I'm not hungry for you. I'm hungry for a chicken, some bread, and soup. Okay. Haven't eaten in over a century? Get out of my way! Guess it worked. See ya! Okay, I'm a I'm a answer with that device because that makes perfect sense. Hello, this is your herd leader. I'd like you to come back to the barn. I have an important matter to discuss. Okay, I'll be right there. What do you want now? Oh, hello, cat. Uh, advance of friendship. Give a gift. The advance of friendship one is super easy. You should go and do that. 
I was just in the bar and so I suppose this is easy. I mean, I just did a lot of Barney stunks. I I want to advance a friendship with you. Pretend. Mm -hmm. Your hard deck. Hey, Clara. Grom is it? Bien bien place. Yup. Come on, sir. Oh, I should have a map. Friendships has been advanced. <laughs>